Chapter 1. The Power of Thought Welcome to As You Think So You Are. Let your thoughts create everything you want. This audiobook is designed to guide you on a journey of self-discovery and empowerment, grounded in the principle that your thoughts shape your reality. By harnessing the power of your mind, you can create the life you've always desired. This chapter lays the foundation for understanding how your thoughts influence your life and how you can begin to consciously control them to your advantage. The Essence of Thought Everything begins with a thought. From the grandest skyscrapers to the simplest household tools, all were once mere ideas in someone's mind. This same process applies to the creation of your life. Your consistent thoughts and beliefs shape your actions and ultimately, your reality. By understanding this, you can begin to harness the power of thought to manifest your desires. Your Mental Blueprint Think of your mind as a garden. Just as a gardener cultivates his plot, keeping it free from weeds and growing the flowers and fruits he requires, so must you tend the garden of your mind. Weed out all the negative, self-defeating thoughts, and cultivate the positive, uplifting, and productive ones. By doing so, you create a mental environment where your dreams can take root and grow. The Role of Conscious Awareness To change your reality, you must first become acutely aware of the thoughts that fill your mind. Are they negative or positive? Do they build you up or tear you down? The process of change begins with awareness because you cannot change what you do not acknowledge. Start by observing your thoughts without judgment. This practice will help you identify the predominant patterns of your thinking. Shifting Paradigms Identifying Limiting Beliefs Many of us carry limiting beliefs that we've picked up from past experiences, society, or familial conditioning. These beliefs often operate in the background, subtly influencing our behavior and decisions. Identify these beliefs by reflecting on areas of your life where you feel stuck or unsatisfied. What thoughts recur in these areas? Recognizing these patterns is the first step in transforming them. Creating new beliefs. Once you've identified the limiting beliefs holding you back, it's time to replace them with empowering ones. This is not about mere positive thinking, but about deeply ingrained beliefs that resonate with your desires and goals. For example, replace the belief, I am not good enough, with I am fully capable and deserving of success. Visualization, a tool for change. Visualization is a powerful technique for embedding new beliefs in your subconscious. Regularly visualize yourself achieving your goals and living the life you desire. Imagine it in vivid detail, the sights, the sounds, the emotions. This practice not only reinforces your new beliefs, but also aligns your subconscious mind with your conscious goals. Practical Steps for Thought Transformation Daily Thought Management Morning Intentions Start each day by setting clear, positive intentions. Decide how you want to feel and what you want to achieve. Thought Journal Keep a journal to track your thoughts and the emotions they evoke. This will help you become more aware and in control of your thought patterns. Affirmations Use affirmations to strengthen your new beliefs. Repeat them throughout the day to keep your focus and energy aligned with your goals. The Role of Discipline Changing thought patterns requires discipline and persistence. It's a daily practice that involves constant monitoring and adjustment of your thoughts. Like any skill, it becomes more natural over time, but it does require effort and dedication. Chapter 2. Harnessing Emotions to Empower Thoughts Emotions as energy emotions fuel the power of your thoughts. Each feeling you experience sends a unique vibration throughout your body, which can either empower or hinder your thoughts. When you align your emotional energy with your thoughts, you create a powerful force that can manifest your deepest desires. Emotional Mastery To utilize emotions effectively, you must first learn to master them. This doesn't mean suppressing your feelings, but understanding and directing them constructively. Emotions are signals that tell you about your alignment or misalignment with your desires. By recognizing these signals, you can guide your thoughts to be more in tune with what you truly want. The Power of Positive Emotions Positive emotions such as joy, 
love, and excitement amplify your ability to attract what you desire. These feelings open you up, expanding your creativity and increasing your capacity for action. Cultivate these emotions by engaging in activities that make you feel good and by surrounding yourself with people who uplift you. Thought Patterns and Emotional Loops Breaking Negative Loops Negative emotional loops can be detrimental, causing a spiral of destructive thoughts and feelings. To break free from these loops, start by identifying triggers that cause negative emotions. Once identified, you can create a plan to react differently. This might involve deep breathing, changing your environment, or reframing your thoughts to focus on positive outcomes. Cultivating Positive Loops As you work to disrupt negative loops, you also need to create positive ones. This can be achieved by deliberately choosing thoughts that generate positive emotions. Over time, these positive loops will become your default, enhancing your overall well-being and your ability to manifest your goals. Emotional Anchoring Technique of Anchoring Anchoring is a technique where you create a physical or mental reminder that helps evoke a particular emotional state. This could be as simple as a touch on your wrist or a specific phrase that you repeat. Use anchoring to bring forth feelings of confidence and positivity when you face challenges or need a boost to keep moving towards your goals. Building your emotional toolkit. Develop a toolkit of emotional anchors that you can call upon in various situations. Each anchor should be linked to a powerful, positive memory or feeling that will help recalibrate your emotional state and keep your thoughts aligned with your objectives. Practical Emotional Strategies Emotional Planning Just as you plan your day or week, plan your emotional approaches to anticipated situations. If you know certain events or tasks elicit stress or anxiety, prepare by deciding which positive emotions you will focus on to counteract these feelings. Emotional Agility Being emotionally agile means being able to shift your emotional state according to the needs of the moment. This skill allows you to remain effective and focused, no matter what challenges arise. Develop emotional agility by practicing mindfulness and being fully present in the moment, allowing you to better manage your emotional responses. Harnessing the Power of Gratitude Gratitude is a profound emotional tool that can transform your outlook on life. Regular practice of gratitude can shift your focus from what's missing to what's abundant. This shift not only improves your mood but also attracts more positivity into your life. Start and end each day by listing three things you are grateful for. This simple practice can dramatically shift your emotional and thought patterns towards more productive and fulfilling paths. Chapter 3. Crafting Your Mindset for Success Mindset, the bedrock of achievement. Your mindset determines your approach to life and its challenges. A growth mindset, one that thrives on challenge and sees failures as opportunities for growth, is essential for achieving your aspirations. This chapter explores how to cultivate such a mindset and leverage it for personal and professional success. The power of a growth mindset. Embrace challenges and persist in the face of setbacks. This mindset shifts from seeing obstacles as insurmountable barriers to viewing them as opportunities to learn and evolve. When you adopt this perspective, every failure becomes a stepping stone towards success. Shifting from fixed to growth. If you currently have a fixed mindset, one that dodges challenges and feels threatened by the success of others, it's time to transition. Begin by acknowledging your potential for growth and change. Understand that your abilities are not static but can be developed through dedication and hard work. Self-talk and internal dialogue. The language of success. The words you use to talk to yourself influence your self-perception and confidence. Use positive, empowering language even when facing difficulties. Instead of saying, I can't do this, try, I haven't mastered this yet, but I will learn. This subtle shift in language can dramatically change your internal narrative and impact your performance. Rewriting Your Story Every thought you have is part of the story you tell yourself about who you are. To change your life, start by changing your story. Rewrite any part of your narrative that limits you or holds you back. Emphasize your strengths, your resilience, and your ability to overcome adversity. Building Resilience The Role of Resilience in Success 
Resilience is the ability to bounce back from setbacks and adapt to challenging circumstances. It is a crucial component of a growth mindset. Cultivate resilience by setting realistic expectations and maintaining a long-term perspective in your pursuits. Techniques for Enhancing Resilience Practice mindfulness and stress reduction techniques to enhance your resilience. Regularly engage in activities that reduce stress, such as meditation, yoga, or simple deep breathing exercises. These practices help maintain your mental health and enhance your ability to cope with stress. Setting Goals That Foster Growth SMART Goals Set specific, measurable, achievable, relevant, and time-bound goals that align with your long-term vision. SMART Goals provide clarity and a deadline, making it easier to focus and measure progress. The Importance of Micro Goals Break your larger goals into smaller manageable tasks. These micro goals should be achievable in a short period and contribute to the overall objective. This strategy helps maintain motivation and makes the process of achieving large goals less daunting. Embracing continuous learning, lifelong learning as a mindset. Adopt the mindset of a lifelong learner. The world is always changing, and continuous learning is key to staying relevant and competitive. Engage in regular training and education to enhance your skills and stay updated with your industry. Learning from others Never underestimate the value of learning from others. Seek mentorship and advice from those who have walked the path before you. Attend workshops, seminars, and other educational events to expand your network and learn new perspectives and strategies. Chapter 4. The Art of Discipline and Consistency Discipline. The Gateway to Freedom Discipline is often misunderstood as a restriction of freedom, but it is in fact the pathway to achieving it. True freedom comes from the ability to choose your actions wisely and consistently, aligning them with your goals and visions. This chapter delves into the mechanisms of developing a disciplined lifestyle that propels you towards success. Cultivating Daily Discipline Begin by establishing routines that anchor your day, whether it's a morning workout, a fixed study schedule, or dedicated time for reflection. These routines build a framework of discipline. Stick to your plans even when the initial motivation wanes. Remember, discipline is what keeps you going when the excitement fades. The Role of Habit Formation Habits are the building blocks of discipline. By creating positive habits, you automate good behaviors and make it easier to adhere to your goals. Focus on one habit at a time allowing yourself to fully integrate it into your life before adding another. Over time, these habits will become second nature, reducing the mental effort needed to make productive choices. Consistency, the key to mastery. To master any skill, consistency is crucial. It's not about intense bursts of effort, but rather about regular, steady practice. The compound effect of small daily actions leads to significant achievements over time. Maintaining Momentum Once you start a task, keep the momentum going. Don't let procrastination or distractions derail your progress. If you stumble one day, pick up where you left off as soon as possible. Consistency in your efforts reinforces the neural pathways needed for skill acquisition and deep learning. Setting a pace you can sustain It's important to set a pace that is challenging yet sustainable. If you push too hard, you risk burnout, but if you go too easy, you may not make significant progress. Find your balance and adjust as needed, keeping in mind your long-term objectives. Accountability Systems – Self-Accountability Hold yourself accountable by regularly reviewing your goals and progress. Use journals, apps, or simple checklists to track your activities. This reflection allows you to stay aware of your progress and motivates you to continue. External accountability. Sometimes, external accountability can be more effective. Share your goals with a friend, join a group with similar interests, or hire a coach. Knowing that someone else expects results can significantly increase your commitment. Overcoming obstacles to discipline. Identifying and removing distractions. Be proactive in identifying potential distractions that could derail your discipline. Once identified, develop strategies to minimize or eliminate these distractions. 
This might involve setting boundaries with others, organizing your workspace, or limiting your use of technology during work hours, adapting to changing circumstances. Flexibility is important. When circumstances change, be ready to adapt your methods but keep your eyes on the goal. Being too rigid can lead to frustration and failure, so adjust your plans as necessary while maintaining your commitment to discipline and consistency. Rewarding yourself. Recognize and celebrate your successes, no matter how small. Rewarding yourself not only boosts your morale, but also reinforces the behavior you want to continue. Choose rewards that are meaningful and contribute to your goals, like a new book if you're a writer or a day off if you've been working overtime. Chapter 5. Nurturing Your Relationships for Success The Importance of Supportive Relationships Relationships are the scaffolding of your personal and professional life. The people you surround yourself with influence your thoughts, behaviors, and ultimately, your success. Cultivating supportive, enriching relationships is crucial in creating an environment where you can thrive. Choosing your circle wisely. Evaluate the people around you. Do they uplift you or do they drain your energy? It's essential to surround yourself with individuals who not only support your goals, but also challenge you to grow and excel. Distance yourself from negativity or anyone who undermines your aspirations. Building relationships that elevate focus on building relationships with people who share your values and ambitions. These relationships become a powerful network of mutual support and inspiration. Attend networking events, join clubs, or participate in online forums related to your interests to connect with like-minded individuals. Effective Communication Skills The Art of Listening Good communication is rooted in listening. By actively listening, you show respect and gain a deeper understanding of others, which enhances your relationships. Practice listening without preparing your response. Focus on understanding the speaker's perspective fully before you reply. Expressing yourself clearly. Learn to express your thoughts and feelings clearly and respectfully. Effective communication is not just about conveying your ideas, but doing so in a way that they are received and understood. Tailor your communication style to your audience to maximize clarity and impact. Reciprocity in relationships. The give and take. A healthy relationship is a balance of give and take. Be generous with your time, resources, and support, but also be open to receiving help. This reciprocity builds stronger bonds and creates a network of resources that you can tap into when you need them. Being a positive influence. Strive to be a positive influence in the lives of others. Encourage friends and colleagues, celebrate their successes, and offer help when needed. By fostering positivity, you cultivate a supportive circle that not only benefits you, but also enhances the lives of those around you. Conflict Resolution Approaching Conflicts Constructively, conflicts are inevitable in any relationship, but they don't have to lead to negative outcomes. Approach conflicts constructively, aiming for a solution that benefits all parties. Discuss issues openly and honestly while maintaining respect for everyone involved. Learning from disagreements. View disagreements as learning opportunities. Each conflict presents a chance to understand different perspectives and can strengthen relationships if handled properly. Reflect on each experience to improve your conflict resolution skills. The Role of Empathy Developing Empathy Empathy is the ability to understand and share the feelings of another. Develop your empathy by putting yourself in others' shoes and considering their feelings and circumstances. This understanding is key to building deep and lasting relationships. Using empathy to connect. Use empathy to connect with people on a deeper level. When you relate to others' experiences and emotions, you build trust and rapport. This connection is invaluable in personal and professional settings as it fosters collaboration and support. Maintaining long-term relationships. Consistent effort. Like any valuable aspect of life, maintaining relationships requires consistent effort. Regularly check in with your contacts, offer your help without being asked, and celebrate special occasions with them. These efforts keep relationships strong, and enduring. Adapting to life's changes. As life evolves, so do relationships. 
Be prepared to adapt to changes in your relationships as circumstances change. Keep communication open and be willing to adjust your expectations and contributions to suit the current reality of the relationship. Chapter 6. Embracing Change and Overcoming Fear Change as a Catalyst for Growth Change is an inevitable part of life and a vital component of growth. Embrace change as an opportunity to evolve and enhance your capabilities. Those who adapt to change swiftly and gracefully can navigate life's uncertainties with confidence and success. Recognizing the Value of Change Understand that change often brings about new opportunities that would not have arisen otherwise. By shifting your perspective to view change as beneficial, you can transform apprehension into action. Look for the silver lining in each change you face and consider how it can contribute to your personal and professional development. Preparing for Change Stay ahead by preparing for change before it arrives. Keep learning and stay informed about your field and the world around you. Flexibility in your plans allows you to adapt more readily when circumstances shift. Overcoming the fear of the unknown Fear of the unknown can be a significant barrier to success. Overcome this fear by building confidence in your ability to handle whatever comes your way. Trust in your skills, your preparation, and your ability to learn from challenges. Steps to Conquer Fear Identify specific fears. Write down what you're afraid of and why. Understanding the roots of your fear can diminish its power. Challenge negative thoughts. Replace fearful thoughts with affirmations and evidence of your past successes and strengths. Take small steps. Break down daunting tasks into manageable actions. Small successes will build your confidence and reduce fear. Utilizing fear as motivation. Rather than allowing fear to paralyze you, use it as a catalyst for preparation and action. The adrenaline that fear produces can be channeled into motivation to improve your readiness and performance. Learning from Fear Reflect on each experience of fear as a learning opportunity. Analyze what triggered your fear and how you responded. This reflection will help you handle future fears more effectively and turn them into constructive challenges. Adaptability in the Face of Change Being adaptable in the face of change is a key trait of successful individuals. Adaptability means being open to new ideas, altering your methods, and even changing your goals as necessary to align with new realities. Enhancing Adaptability Develop a diverse skill set. The more skills you have, the easier it is to adapt to change. Cultivate a positive attitude. View changes and challenges as ways to test and refine your abilities. Stay connected. Maintain a strong network. Relationships can provide support and open up new opportunities in times of change. Building Resilience Through Change Resilience is strengthened by experiencing and overcoming adversity. Each challenge you face and navigate increases your resilience and equips you better for future challenges. Techniques to build resilience maintain physical and mental health. Regular exercise, a healthy diet, and mindfulness practices like meditation can enhance your overall resilience. Set realistic expectations. Be realistic about what you can achieve and by when. This will help you stay grounded and focused. Seek support when needed. Don't hesitate to ask for help. Utilizing your support network can make managing change less stressful. Continuous improvement. Strive for continuous improvement in all areas of your life. This commitment to perpetual growth not only prepares you for change, but also positions you to seize opportunities that arise from unexpected quarters. Chapter 7. The Power of Positive Thinking. Harnessing the Mind's Potential. Your mind is a powerful tool that can manifest immense success or contribute to your downfall. It all depends on how you use it. Positive thinking isn't just about expecting the best to happen. It's about accepting that whatever happens is the best for a given moment. Reframing Thoughts Reframe your perspective to transform challenges into opportunities and failures into lessons. This shift in thinking encourages a more optimistic outlook and a proactive approach to life. When faced with a setback, ask yourself, what can I learn from this? Or, how can this situation improve me? Sustaining Optimism 
Maintain an optimistic outlook by regularly engaging in activities that promote positivity. This could include reading uplifting literature, engaging in uplifting conversations, or practicing gratitude. Optimism isn't about ignoring life's pressures, but about maintaining a mindset that anticipates good outcomes. Building a positive environment. Your environment significantly affects your mental state. Create a space that enhances your positivity through order, beauty, and inspirational elements. This could be as simple as keeping a clean workspace, decorating with vibrant colors, or displaying motivational quotes where you can see them daily. Choosing your influences. Be deliberate about the people and media you allow into your life. Surround yourself with positive influences, people who uplift you and media that feed your mind with constructive information. Limit exposure to negativity, whether from certain individuals, news sources, or online content. Cultivating joy and contentment. Joy and contentment are integral components of a positive life. These emotions stem from appreciating what you have and not fixating on what's lacking. Cultivate these feelings by practicing mindfulness and living in the present moment. Practices to enhance joy. Engage in play. Set aside time for play and relaxation. Activities you enjoy can significantly boost your mood and outlook. Celebrate small wins. Recognize and celebrate even your smallest achievements. This acknowledgement builds a sense of accomplishment and happiness. Mindfulness and positive thinking. Mindfulness involves being fully present and engaged in the moment, aware of your thoughts and feelings without judgment. By practicing mindfulness, you can manage your thoughts more effectively, leading to enhanced positive thinking. Techniques for practicing mindfulness meditation. Regular meditation helps calm the mind and center your thoughts. Deep breathing exercises. These can help reduce stress and promote a peaceful state of mind, making it easier to maintain positive thoughts. Using affirmations to strengthen positivity. Affirmations are positive statements that can help you challenge and overcome self-sabotaging and negative thoughts. Repeat affirmations daily to reinforce positive thinking and self-belief. Crafting effective affirmations. Make sure your affirmations are positive in the present tense and believable. Phrases like, I am capable of achieving greatness or I am worthy of success can be powerful motivators that enhance your mindset. The role of resilience in positive thinking. Resilience allows you to navigate through difficulties without losing your optimistic outlook. Strengthen your resilience by remaining flexible, focusing on solutions rather than problems, and viewing obstacles as temporary setbacks. Strategies to develop resilience. Stay connected. Maintain a strong support network that you can lean on during tough times. Be proactive. Don't wait for crises to occur. Anticipate potential challenges and think about how to handle them positively. Chapter 8. Mastering Time Management Time is a resource. Time is one of your most precious resources. Unlike money or energy, time cannot be replenished. Once it's gone, it's gone forever. Mastering the management of your time is crucial for achieving your goals and maintaining a balanced life. Prioritization. The key to efficient time management. Start by identifying the most important tasks, those that have significant long-term impacts on your goals. Use techniques like the Eisenhower box to categorize tasks into urgent, important, both, or neither. Focus your energy on tasks that are both urgent and important to maximize productivity. The art of saying no. Learning to say no is vital in time management. Protect your time by declining requests that do not align with your goals or that could distract you from more critical tasks. This skill ensures that you are not overextended and that your energy is preserved for tasks that truly matter. Structuring your day. The power of routines. Establishing a daily routine helps streamline your day and frees up mental energy from decision making. Consistent routines set the stage for productive days as they incorporate time for both focused work and necessary breaks. Time blocking technique. Time blocking is a method of calendar management that helps you visualize how you spend your day. Allocate blocks of time for specific activities, including work, meetings, and personal time. 
This method reduces the friction of starting tasks and helps prevent task overrun. Delegation and automation leveraging delegation delegate tasks that do not require your specific expertise. Delegation allows you to focus on higher value activities that necessitate your attention. Train your team or colleagues well to handle tasks you delegate to ensure quality and consistency. The role of automation. Automate repetitive tasks with technology. Use tools for scheduling, reminders, and managing emails and social media. Automation helps you focus on tasks that require human judgment and creativity, optimizing your productivity. Overcoming procrastination. Understanding the causes procrastination often stems from fear, overwhelm, or a lack of clear goals. Understanding why you procrastinate is the first step in overcoming this barrier. Once you know the cause, you can apply specific strategies to tackle it. Strategies to beat procrastination. Break tasks into smaller steps. This makes them less daunting and easier to start. Set clear deadlines. Deadlines create urgency and can motivate you to complete tasks. Use rewards. Reward yourself for completing tasks to create positive reinforcement. Managing distractions. Identifying distractions. Identify what typically distracts you. Social media, emails, chatty coworkers, etc. Awareness allows you to develop strategies to mitigate these distractions. Creating a distraction-free environment. Create an environment that minimizes distractions. This may involve physical changes, like organizing your workspace or using noise-canceling headphones, and digital strategies, like using apps that block distracting websites during work hours. The importance of rest balancing productivity with rest balance. Intense periods of work with quality rest. Rest, including sleep and downtime, is essential for maintaining long-term productivity and health. Neglecting rest can lead to burnout and decreased efficiency. Techniques for effective rest. Regular breaks. Use techniques like the Pomodoro technique. Work for a set period, then take a short break. Quality sleep. Prioritize getting enough sleep, as it is crucial for recovery and performance. Chapter 9. The Art of Goal Setting. Defining Clear, Actionable Goals The foundation of success is the ability to set and achieve goals. Clear, well-defined goals provide direction and a benchmark for measuring progress. Begin by identifying what you truly want to achieve, both in your personal and professional life. Specificity in Goal Setting Goals must be specific. Vague aspirations like be successful or lose weight lack the detail needed to be actionable. Instead, Articulate your goals with precision. Increase annual revenue by 20% or lose 15 pounds by July. The importance of measurable goals. Ensure that your goals are measurable. By establishing concrete criteria for success, you can track your progress and make adjustments as needed. Measurable goals help maintain motivation and provide a sense of accomplishment as you approach your targets. Aligning goals with values consistency between goals and personal values. Your goals should reflect your core values. This alignment ensures that your efforts feel meaningful and fulfilling rather than like obligations. When goals and values are in sync, you are more likely to pursue them with enthusiasm and dedication. Long-term vision and short-term objectives. Align your short-term objectives with your long-term vision. This strategy ensures that each day's efforts contribute to your overarching ambitions. It creates a roadmap for success that keeps you motivated and focused. The power of writing down goals. The act of writing as commitment. Writing down your goals reinforces your commitment to achieving them. The physical act of writing makes your goals tangible and serves as a constant reminder of what you aim to achieve. Keeping goals visible. Keep your written goals in a place where you will see them daily. This visibility reminds you of your priorities and helps keep your focus aligned with your objectives. Overcoming obstacles to goal achievement. Anticipating challenges. Anticipate potential obstacles to your goals. By thinking ahead about challenges, you can devise strategies to overcome them before they arise. Adapting strategies flexibly. Be prepared to adapt your strategies as circumstances change. 
Flexibility is key to overcoming challenges and keeping your goals within reach, even when unexpected changes occur. The Role of Accountability in Goal Achievement Self-Accountability Hold yourself accountable for your progress. Regular check-ins, whether daily, weekly, or monthly, can help you stay on track. Use tools like journals, apps, or spreadsheets to monitor your advancements. Seeking external accountability. Sometimes, external accountability provides the extra motivation needed to pursue your goals relentlessly. Share your objectives with a mentor, coach, or peer group who can provide support and hold you accountable. Celebrating milestones. Recognizing progress. Celebrate each milestone you achieve toward your goals. These celebrations reinforce positive behaviors and keep morale high. Adjusting goals post milestone. After reaching a milestone, take the time to review and adjust your goals as necessary. This adjustment might involve setting higher targets or extending your timeline based on what you've learned and experienced. Chapter 10 Cultivating Leadership Skills Leadership and Self Understanding Leadership starts with a deep understanding of oneself. To lead others effectively, you must first manage yourself. This involves recognizing your strengths and weaknesses, your emotional triggers, and your values. Self-assessment tools Utilize self-assessment tools such as personality tests, 360-degree feedback, or strength finders to gain insights into your behavior and how others perceive you. These tools provide a foundation for personal development and effective leadership. Embracing Self-Improvement Commit to continuous self-improvement. Attend workshops, read extensively, and seek feedback regularly. This commitment not only enhances your skills, but also sets a powerful example for others to follow. Effective Communication and Leadership Clear and Inspirational Communication a leader's ability to communicate clearly and inspiratively is crucial. Whether you are explaining a vision, instructing a team, or delivering feedback, your words should motivate and encourage understanding and collaboration. Active listening skills. Develop active listening skills. This means truly hearing what others say and responding thoughtfully. Active listening builds trust and respect, which are essential for effective leadership. Building and leading teams. Creating a cohesive team. Focus on building a team that complements each other's skills and strengths. Encourage collaboration by clearly defining roles and fostering a culture of mutual respect and support. Leading by example. Lead by example. Your actions set the tone for the behavior and ethics of your team. Demonstrating integrity, dedication, and respect in your actions encourages your team to uphold these values in their work. Decision-making and problem-solving strategic thinking. Develop your strategic thinking abilities. Consider not only the immediate effects of decisions, but also their long-term implications. This foresight can prevent problems and foster sustainable success. Handling pressure and making decisions. Learn to handle pressure with grace. In leadership, you will face high-stress situations that require calm and decisive decision-making. Practice stress management techniques and decision-making under various pressures to refine these skills. Empowering others. Delegation as a tool for empowerment. Effective delegation is not about offloading work. It's about empowering your team. Assign tasks based on individual strengths and provide the necessary support. This empowerment helps develop your team's skills and confidence. Encouraging professional growth. Encourage the professional growth of your team. Provide opportunities for training and advancement, and support their goals within and beyond the organization. Investing in your team's growth not only enhances their performance, but also their loyalty and engagement. Ethical leadership and integrity. Upholding ethics and integrity. Maintain high ethical standards and integrity. The ethical conduct of a leader influences the entire organization, shaping its culture and public reputation. Transparency in Leadership Practice transparency in your decisions and actions. Openness fosters trust and credibility, both crucial for effective leadership. Navigating change leading through change. Be adept at leading through change. Provide clear direction and support as your team navigates new challenges. 
Your ability to remain focused and positive sets the tone for your team's response to change. Innovating and adapting. Encourage innovation and adaptability in your team. Foster an environment where new ideas are welcomed and tested, and where flexibility is a valued asset. Chapter 11. Financial Wisdom for Life. Understanding personal finance. Managing your finances effectively is crucial for both personal satisfaction and professional success. It begins with a solid understanding of basic financial principles, including budgeting, saving, and investing. The Importance of Financial Literacy Increase your financial literacy by educating yourself on financial basics. Read books, take courses, and seek advice from financial professionals. Understanding these concepts empowers you to make informed decisions about your money. Creating a Budget Develop a comprehensive budget that tracks your income and expenses. A budget is a foundational tool that helps you manage your finances by highlighting where your money goes and where you can cut back to save more. Saving and Investing Building an Emergency Fund Start by building an emergency fund to cover unexpected expenses. Aim to save at least three to six months' worth of living expenses. This fund serves as a financial buffer that can prevent debt during emergencies. Principles of Investing Understand the basics of investing, including the different types of investments, stocks, bonds, real estate, and the risks associated with each. The goal of investing is to put your money to work so it grows over time. Managing Debt Good Debt versus Bad Debt Learn to differentiate between good debt, like a mortgage or business loan, and bad debt, like high-interest credit card debt. Manage debt wisely by maintaining low interest rates and paying off high interest debts first. Strategies for reducing debt. Implement strategies for debt reduction, such as the debt snowball method, paying off debts from smallest to largest, or the debt avalanche method, paying off debts with the highest interest rates first. Financial planning for the future, retirement planning. Start planning for retirement early. The sooner you begin saving, the more time your money has to grow through the power of compound interest. Utilize retirement accounts like IRAs and 401 Ks to optimize your savings. Estate planning. Consider your long-term financial legacy. Estate planning involves creating a will, setting up trusts, and making sure your assets are transferred smoothly and according to your wishes. Wealth Building Mindset. Investing in Yourself. Investing in yourself is one of the best returns on investments you can get. It could be investing in your education, health, or starting a business. When you improve yourself, you enhance your ability to earn more. The Psychology of Money Understand the psychological aspects of money, including your personal money beliefs and behaviors. Addressing these can help you break unhealthy patterns and build more productive financial habits. Navigating financial challenges. Dealing with financial stress. Develop strategies to cope with financial stress. Keep a positive outlook. Focus on controllable factors and seek professional advice if needed. Adapting to financial changes. Be prepared to adjust your financial plans as your life circumstances change. This flexibility can help you maintain financial stability even when unexpected changes occur. Chapter 12. Achieving Personal Excellence The Pursuit of Excellence Personal excellence is not about being perfect. It's about constantly striving to improve yourself and your circumstances. It involves a commitment to learning and growth, regardless of the challenges that come your way. Continuous Self-Improvement Make a lifelong commitment to learning. Whether through formal education, self-study, or experiential learning, Continuously expanding your knowledge and skills is crucial. It enriches your life and ensures you remain competitive and relevant in your field. Setting High Standards Set high standards for yourself in all areas of life, including work, relationships, and personal development. High standards help you achieve greater levels of performance and satisfaction. Mindfulness and Self-Awareness Cultivating Mindfulness Practice mindfulness to enhance your self-awareness. Mindfulness helps you understand your thoughts, feelings, and reactions, which is crucial for personal development. It allows you to make more deliberate and thoughtful decisions. 
Reflection and Growth Regular reflection on your experiences and decisions is vital for growth. Use journals, meditation, or therapy to reflect. This practice can reveal patterns in your behavior that you may want to enhance or change. Balancing Ambition with Well-Being Prioritizing Health Your physical and mental health are the foundations of your ability to pursue and achieve excellence. Prioritize regular exercise, a balanced diet, sufficient sleep, and mental health care. Work-life balance. Achieving personal excellence requires finding a balance between ambition and personal life. Ensure you make time for relationships, hobbies, and relaxation. These aspects of life are crucial for a fulfilling existence and can also enhance your productivity and creativity. Resilience and perseverance. Building resilience, develop resilience to weather the inevitable ups and downs of life. This trait allows you to bounce back from failures and setbacks stronger than before. The power of perseverance. Perseverance is key to achieving long-term goals. It's the ability to keep moving forward, regardless of obstacles. Cultivate perseverance by setting clear goals, maintaining a positive outlook, and breaking tasks into manageable steps. Leadership and Influence Expanding influence. Extend your influence by being a role model and mentor to others. Sharing your knowledge and experiences can help others grow while also enhancing your sense of purpose and satisfaction. Ethical leadership practice ethical leadership. This means making decisions that are not only effective, but also morally sound. Ethical leadership earns you respect and long-lasting trust. Creating a legacy impact on others. Consider the impact of your actions on others and on the world. Strive to leave a positive legacy through your professional work, community service, and personal interactions. Long-term vision. Maintain a long-term vision for your life. Think about how you want to be remembered and what you can do each day to work towards that vision. This perspective helps you focus on what truly matters. Achieving personal excellence is a dynamic process that requires dedication, discipline, and a conscious effort to grow and improve. By integrating these principles into your life, you can lead a life of purpose, fulfillment, and impact, making a meaningful difference in your own life and the lives of others around you.